is my Oscar and Koi. Um, as you can see like, from the reflection, that's my Koi. I got it from my friend. And this is my albino Oscar. For some reason, it's turning black. Uh, yeah, he's an albino Oscar. Really close out there. And he, all he has is an orange spot on his tail. Uh, that's the only orange that he has. Other than that, he's not supposed to be from turning black. And it's an albino Oscar. Markation. Pretty big fish. So that's the coin. Um, other than that, I have these um, these black um, guppies. I bred them. This is my. Let's see. Third or fourth year in making this strain very strong, uh, very solid black. This is cross between the Walmart um, black that I usually get at Walmart here in Hawaii, and then the Russian grass puppy. So if you notice, uh, this male here, who is that one male? There is a male here that has a the dorsal fin being silver, and all the rest of the body is black. I believe it's this one right here. Um, that's pretty much my breed. Other than that, um, yeah, the veal tail is pretty strong if you see it. Um, so it's pretty strong. Um, if you can see all the um, fry on the surface, I do have at least maybe close to, geez, a good 60. 60 to 70 on in there already. Um, with three large males and two large females. Here's the large females. One of them has a definite um, veal tail. The other one is still the um, that Walmart black with a um, short tail. So crossbreeding it constant, and my end result should be like this one down below, right here. And as you can see, he's right there with the top dorsal fin being silver. So, yep, that's the final result of three years, three to four years of work. So hopefully, all these little guys will come out the same still. Yeah, just like this guy right here. Kidok, and for another video. See you later.